are back in the kitchen here on Hot Plate. Of course, I'm Claire Carato. And I'm Chef Bennett. <laughs> now, if you're joining us for the very first time, then we are about to introduce you to a world of flavor. Mm -hmm. Of course, here on Hot Plate, we recreate delicious meals, Kenyan meals, where Chef adds a little bit of his flavor, mm -hmm. his flavor into it by switching it up, switching up the game and ensuring that we make easy Kenyan re recipes, sorry, with a twist. Mm -hmm. Of course, there are some times that we don't necessarily do Kenyan meals, but of course, we make m amazing meals with readily available ingredients. Mm. Of course, these are ingredients that you can get from the supermarkets or from the Soko, you know, to be able to just easily cook these meals at home. Uh, now, Chef usually has a lineup of either competitors, whereby we have you, our viewers, joining us in this very kitchen. And of course, going head to head with a, with a loved one, with a friend, uh, sometimes challenging Chef or myself. Mm. And of course, we have guests who join us in this kitchen as we get to learn a little bit more about them. It's like an interview with a little bit of fun. Salute. Actually, with a lot of fun. <laughs> because, I mean, what better way, what better way to get to know somebody mm. other than getting to cook with them because I feel like food is something that's very intimate to myself and chef. Therefore, getting to invite them to our space to cook with us as we learn about them is very personal to us. Uh, we're looking forward to have you, our viewers. Now, if you have been inboxing us, we are going to get back to you. Mm. And of a course. big that's shout out. I yes, been, definitely. I you've been doing too. Ah, yes. Kabisa. Okay. And of course, a big <laughs> shout out to those who've been showing us love. Continue stopping us, telling us we love your show. We mm. appreciate it so much. Honestly, we are so humbled about that. And of course, those who've been inboxing us saying that they tune in every Monday and Tuesday at 6 p.m. here on Hot Day. We appreciate you. Thank you for tuning in. Mm. Now, uh, Chef has a uh, First off, if you have not caught up on some of the recipes <laughs> that we have done, you can do so by going onto YouTube. That's Ebru TV. Uh, that's Hot Plate on YouTube. You can catch up on some of the recipes that we've been able to prepare here in this very kitchen. That's All right, nice. Chef, what are we having today? Because I can see mince meat. Uh -huh. We've got mkate in a tray. So you need to be <laughs> explaining what we're doing yeah. uh, with this. Of course, also today we're going to make something different. Yes. Uh, meatball subs. Okay. And basically, it's just a sandwich. Instead of like, uh, the traditional hot dogs, yeah. we're going to put meatballs there with the sauce, with it's some, some cheese. It's some meatballs. Yeah. We're going to put some meatball cheese in there. I know, right? I know. Chef, you know why I love the fact that you always incorporate cheese in the meals? Because mm. I'm just like, I'm a cheesy person. <laughs> I love me some cheese in there. Also this guy. You too, eh? Uh -huh. Cheesy. All right. <laughs> now, I know we are being joined by very talented uh, young gentlemen who are joining mm -hmm. us in the kitchen today. Now, I don't know if they're going to be going head to head. What are we going to uh, put so for them so today? I'm going to say that I'm going to say that I'm going to say Food. Oh, properly. Mm, yeah. Aya, sour basi. Kwaivo, maybe you can be able to call them. Ndiyo tu anze kupika ju. Mi lazima nge anze kula, so you better call them. Yeah, today we have our very own <laughs> DJ Wash. Yes. And his DJ Miki. Yes, Everybody DJ Wash and DJ Miki Kari Buni sana on hot plate. Finally, <laughs> you have joined us. <laughs> so good to have you. This is our very own, of course, you guys. Oh, nice of you to join us. Kari Buni sana. Okay. <laughs> nice one, nice one, nice one. You can go ahead and have a seat. <laughs> now, if you guys tune in on uh, to Ibru, actually, there is a show. He will be able to tell us a little bit more about what he does. Uh, therefore, we have family and friends joining us into the kitchen today. So maybe we'll start with you, fam. Yep. Tell us a little bit more about <laughs> you and what you do here, because I'm, I'm pretty sure they're, they're familiar with your face. Yeah, uh, um, did you watch? Yes. I usually, I'm usually on the edge mm -hmm. uh, every Thursday. That is the dance hall Thursdays. Yes. And niningin. Niningin. Simi ni mekam kupika. Ah, mekam kupika. Kupika. Si, you know, to me zoe kupika legs. Oh, right. That's all. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so today, Anapika style yetu. He's cooking. He's on our decks today, on which our, decks. our deck is, uh, by the way, uh, a five banner. This is our decks. No, you must zoe zile two banners too. Sunyo. I'm not a five banner. Sunyo. No, hey, let's be honest. Ours is a five banner from Pneumatic, uh, and of course, it has a blue flame, which you guys will see that they in hurt your pot. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh. All right. Now, um, how about you? I'm Lady Jamiki. Yes. I'm from Bugika Entertainment. Okay. And personally play at Hot 96 okay. from 10 to 2. That's oh, amazing. Man, yeah. That's amazing. Normal, so yeah. Yeah. you guys are usually used to having the headphones on eh? and then just mixing. You don't do a lot of the talking. The yeah. other ones, eh? <laughs> now today you're mixing here. And of course, we will be learning a little bit more about our DJs, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, when did you get interested in being a DJ? And is it something that you taught yourself? Uh, personally, I'm in the game for, I think it's the fifth year. Wow. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
Okay. Actually, how did you guys decide Yani DJ is what we're going to do? Uh, basically yeah. Wait. Okay, I think personally what I can say, yeah? uh. for me, I started DJing while I was in high school, mm. but also for him, eh? definitely Lazima Wanze Mahali. Yeah. Alianza na virtual DJ, I did the same. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but now we met in campus. Okay. Now, I would say for us, YouTube mm, was our was best teacher. School of YouTube, right? Yeah, mm. Aki Lan Kitu, Namini Kilan Kitu, we just go to Naji Fungia, 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 I like the fact that you guys had the friendship level whereby yeah. you could actually learn yeah, together. Kunalo yeah, yeah. say who compete. Like, yeah. ah, we seem show. Like, you'd <laughs> learn by yourself and you're like, and then you want to be better than the other person, which is a bad mentality that yeah. a lot of Kenyans have. Mm. Therefore, I love to see the spirit of, you know, friendship whereby you can actually teach each other. Yeah. And that's something I'd actually ask a lot of us Kenyans to be able to build each other up, yeah? All right. Now, Chef is going to be telling you what we do. We will get to know a little bit more yeah, about yeah. your journey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But Chef, when I'm picking up, I'm going to say, let's pick meatball subs. Instead of lengthwise, but any sandwich food, say I'm But instead of putting hot dogs, I'm a yam at all in, and I've a meatball, and your sauce, some cheese, nini. Alright, mm. mm. and then Chef Ndio Taonesha Mtanza Nanini, uh -huh. and then Ujonas, yes, please just place that there, thank you. Hey, you're a cook, eh? <laughs> I come there, he's already started <laughs> and strapping, I'm like, I don't know about you guys, but do you cook with your jewelry on? Him, he's already removed it and everything. For me, for me, cook is my own, you but cook on the deck. And the deck, <laughs> <laughs> on the deck, right? Yeah, yeah. Which is fine, it's okay. Yeah. I uh, will ask you to stand right mm -hmm. there, a chef instructs you what to do. Now, okay. if you are just joining us we are in the kitchen with two very talented djs of course uh, one of which you have seen on our very station here on ebro and of course his friend who's also plays a lot on the radio i know you don't get to see the faces that are behind the music that you hear on your radio mm -hmm. but you are lucky enough to see the face of the one of the djs who is behind the wonderful music now which sections again did you say you play for me yes I play from 10 to 20 each and every Friday. Each and every yeah. Friday. Mm. What genre of music is it? I play everything. Everything. So long as it's music, it's good for the year. There you <laughs> go. <laughs> All right. So we have them on our decks, of course, mm -hmm. from Pneumatic. And their offices are in James Gishiri Road. You can be able to go and check out their showroom. They have amazing stuff. And they're able to, you know, fix us with a lot of the things that you see here mm. on Hot Play. Now, um, uh, you can go, Chef, take mm. it over. What oh, are they doing? So, Mika Yataka. Yes. I, I want them to mix. Yo, means meat, meat. So now your meatballs are zimu. You season kabsa, na kila kitu leko ni olada, ukisha dishi. So nataka wa urushe means meat up on dani. Yote? Yeah, yote, yote. No si baba. Ah, so so nataka wa side aje, nataka wa anzera salt up, urusha poka. Ni chikwa tu. Chikwa tu, chikwa tu toga po no. Sprinkle it up poka two pinches zivi. Yiko sa? Amadeza kiasi. Unapi Teaspoon and a half, so cayenne pepper. In this, I pili pili sa sila. Weka kanusu yake. So, if I must, what's the difference between this and that black? Like, is it taste? Because I'm kulay yake akwanza yu. Yes, salt and a black pepper. A black pepper nezile ko food zote. Una wana ngapi mende ko salt and pepper to taste. Lazim ay kwe. Ay apo ni paprika. Weka kanusu yu pia ngine. 
Ah, no, that I disagree with that statement. Now, easy to be They're usually even in the in the supermarkets. So guys, please, cayenne pepper, garlic powder, black pepper, they're usually in your supermarkets. Even in your local supermarkets, I can make sure you look for them yeah all right uh they're usually in the spice section which is a dry spice section there you go sasa see you have a kitty kosa sasa is in the bread crumbs is in the cut 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 Uh, we are, but mostly you can use it with stale bread le and you may change it. Eh, uh-huh. na uh-huh. imekauka. kwa bag. Chapa chapa tu kabisa di. Siaga tu yenyewe tu. Ni upika. Uh-huh. Yeah, upika nini? What's your favorite thing to eat? For me I can make it. That's the beauty about it. So sika huyo anasema acha tu hizo tu zipata kwa mtani. Si upikadi chapo. Eh, I cook I cook for him. Ah, that's a way. When when I invite him, when I invite him to come, when I invite him to come and we only have a club so about 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 DJ and the talk and tunaenda, you know. At least najua kunaweza kuwa na misunderstanding. But not the other way around. Okay. We understand yeah. definitely that you love to cook for your friends, which is not a bad thing. Mm. Uh, we'd love to have you actually compete one day with uh, making chapatis, since you make wow. chapatis easily. That would be nice. We would love wow. to have you on the show for that. Uh, actually, initially, we were meant to have them two competing. But since we're making the meatballs, it's fine. We can just make them together. In a car, Jebo. Size Gani. Let's keep doing it now. Mm-hmm. Yes. Joining us is DJ Mickey and DJ Wash, one of our own. And today we're making meatball subs. This is one of my favorites, actually. We pick and I'm telling you, we put that too for me. Hey, must be nice, chef. Our apologies. We're going to be enjoying it too, Nini. Matumbo. But they, I'm not even joking. Like, I love my matumbo. You know that. I'm not even joking. Like, I love my matumbo. You know that. I'm not even joking. Like, I love my matumbo. No way. I'm not even joking. Like, I love my matumbo. Yeah, yeah, they pitang so. Yeah. Of course spices ni kwa nazo kwa hao. Like nimse ushiba. Eh. Kule hizo tatu ndo utaniambia. All right. So, all right guys. Now <laughs> like you said we're making some meatballs. Of course, we mm-hmm. are joined by two talented DJs. Mm-hmm. Now we've just basically mixed up. Ebu tuambie mmeka nini kwenye hiyo nyama. Eh, bwa tukumbushe. Kai. Bila kumbuka. Vile mnaweza kumbuka track list. Nakumbuka kuna black pepper. Yes. And then you know, eh, okay. Yeah. And you know, those Garlic. stamps, those stamps, eh? And those zina kwanga shida. Mimi ni mkenya tu, haina noma. Mimi na mkate. Na kuna kuna mkate na Thiago. At least at least I'm from Kamoja. Yeah, there's bread crumbs in there. All right guys, there is also a little bit of garlic powder, some cayenne uh, yeah. and some paprika. Mm-hmm. Uh there's some dry herbs as well. Which mm-hmm. herbs are those? Chef? Uh we did some uh, thyme and some oregano. Okay, thyme and oregano. Mm-hmm. And that's and, gone in there and they yeah. basically just rubbed so, it. Now what, chef what, what want, next? What I want you guys to do mm-hmm. I think it is in balls. Yeah, uh-huh. table tennis size. So don't give table tennis. Mm. Si kubwa kuliko hii. Katiti. Katiti. <laughs> Now, <there's a> <laughs> Now guys, a, a trick is if you want that you can rub some oil on your hands just Ama for ease of rolling it or some oh. water. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Now kwanza unaanza unaanza kufinyilia so that you make sure that the meat is compact uh-huh. usi, and usi, then usi, and usi. then you roll it. Uh-huh. Yes, kaka kasima. Exactly. Then roll it. There uh-huh. you go. Something That's like perfect. This. Okay, unaitoshi unaongeza? iko sana ajili eh mbona wana ikinya ka sembe hapo si bora tu kwa bora eh sawa eh hivyo sawa hivyo 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 iko sawa now chef what is the next process after ensuring that you have the okay, perfect so, bowl size yeah after the bowl size now we're going to um, sear them a bit okay and then while it's getting seared to ya chakiasi ishike moto po we can start on our sauce then basically hapo nataka wa nikatizo nyanya vitungu Uh, the back to the basics simba. back to basics yeah. nakata vitungu <laughs> chef is giving you the dirty work kwa bia <laughs> right <laughs> chef unajua bei ya nyanya mtani si najua we are making a million dollar meal <laughs> <laughs> now <laughs> guys back to what you guys do now if there's somebody i always love to ask this question if there's somebody at home who's watching who's very interested in becoming a dj yeah. or you know interested in the arts mm-hmm. uh, because a lot of people do it as a side hustle or what not mm-hmm. now What would be the advice you'd give to them? Uh, masomo kwanza. Masomo kwanza. Mm. Mbona? Uh, 
it's a good job by the way, you're my DJ. Mm. But you need to have the same money. Because you need to have the same money. Because you need to have the same money. You need to have the same money. Yeah. Okay. So most people, you know, you say you have talent, yes. He is a DJ. Mm-hmm. I am a land core DJ. But your hustle kuna saa zingine ni zenda iko geuke yeah utafanya mm. nini exactly so you have to be very strategic you have to know what you're doing you lazima uje kama uko kwa ndio ufanye biashara ama uko for fame mm yeah that depend okay mm. that's important how about you for me i think okay i think the, i'll just add something a little mm. to what you said eh mm. usike mm. maji mob mm ndio sema tu kitu moja tu just do your thing eh yeah just believe in yourself fanya kile unapenda yes okay you know for people as much as you say itakuwa ni biza ama nini ama a side hustle kwa wengine it's a real job mm. you know like to me it's a real job yes do despite like i need to shule cause ya ai unajua wazazi lazima so you know kenyans mm. but i think with the african culture when you see tunaenda i think we have to have two side hustles yeah but now if you go in places like out there mtu mm. anatoka tu shule primary akoma in the city and he's getting a job Yeah. So it's who like did you do? Okay. Mm. That's very important. Yeah. But I feel like our um the Kenyan market now is becoming a lot more diverse especially in accepting, you know, DJs as DJing being the main thing because mm. I know a lot of couple of DJs who have a gig every single day and make a good living out of it. Uh therefore what would you say about the industry as a whole? Okay. Are we, we getting better? Okay, we we are getting better each yes. and every day. Yeah. Kila siku kuamka things are going better but ile challenge yetu tuko nayo mm. i think let's support one another okay you don't hate yeah. the other dj at you can dj anapata gig leo wewe upate mm. ah, mi siwezi enda just go pia i'm sure support yeah. i think that's the that's the kitendo cha mahitaji tu kuongeza tu yeah. yeah that's amazing mm. all right chef now we have the balls rolled uh, what is the next step okay, uh, so. as a gentleman wash their hands because they've been handling some meat uh-huh. what is the next step so, uh, no punguze kazi. Okay. Bora <laughs> kumnikatie hizo nyanya. Tafadhali, then we can start on our sauce. Because once we put the the meatballs kwa pan zishike kwanza vizuri, now we can make our sauce sauce. Mbona umechukua ile kisu ndogo? Sina kuanga poa kitu. Really? Hai basi. As you are. Hey, as you control are. Control poor now, mm. All right, chef sasa ndio nakunguzia. You can you do you have a seat as you uh, wait for I'm, them. I'm about Actually, I, I love the kitchen. I love the kitchen. I love the kitchen. Chef, wana mwe kwa kazi yake. Wacha tu wacha wacha basi vinye design ataka tezi vitumbulizi. Oh. Hizi na katoni. Eh? Kata tu cubes. Kama una nipima. Kata tu cubes, 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 cubes. Cubes kubwa ama ndogo? You still we want it is the with us or dogo dogo cubes ndogo i and i will pia ukate dices ivo ivo now basically what this is going to be used for is the sauce that goes onto that meatballs yes chef yes yes, yes. and what we have is a, um, some onions we are cutting the tomatoes into little little cubes um and then he's going to show us what we're going to be doing next now if you're just joining us we haven't gone far basically what we've done is just rolled up the meatballs because mm. we're making a meatball sub of course you can catch up on every single episode on youtube that's on every every tv uh hot plate now we have uh, <laughs> your size ni poa sana hapo sawa hapo sawa baba yeah at least we're jaribu ade ndio tunisemu mimi ndio upika ah Eh? Tazama I like music, pick music. Okay. What's your experience been so far? Now I know for DJing, I had a DJ friend who just told me that whenever you're mixing music, you just want to go with that tempo. Uh, what do you mean? Tempo? Like like I don't know how you guys do it, honestly, yeah. but I know for every music that you're trying to get in, yeah. like if you're trying to incorporate or merge a song with the other, there's a beat that you guys follow that you have to make sure that is Nigeriana. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. In it or BPM. BPM. Mm-hmm. Beats per minute. The beats per minute. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But basically, I think uh no your music ma ku mix ni kupia na story. Okay. Mm-hmm. Bona. Uh, Still on cause mm-hmm. uki mix lazima kuna msi kusi kuna song yenye unatoka kuna nyingine unaweka yeah uh, kuna fa kuna hiyo flow okay yeah mwenye nasikiza nafaa kusikia huyo ametoka 
Yeah. Okay, that's actually very interesting. So there's a lot more technicality to mixing than a lot of people may think. Do there are also people who also uh, just get mixes and then see which song comes after that? Could you, you know, I don't know if you guys are ever seated somewhere and you're listening to music and you know the song that is gonna follow after because you're so used to it always being the next song. Yeah, and then it comes immediately. So is it is it like a thing that it's just a BPM that fits or is it something that now you guys in the industry know that these songs flow together or does it also depend on the genre of music? I think. The best thing is, eh? uh -huh. just know your job, eh? yeah. just know the song. Yeah. Eh? No, for, I, I can just say, for example, eh? mm. yeah? for him, the way he'll play for him, the way he'll play for him, is not the same as he'll play for him. Yeah, yeah, there's a song, everybody's hey, charming. Clear. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. <laughs> hey, hey. hey. Excuse me, please. Let's just not even go there. I am not ashamed of the fact that I do not know what you guys are talking about. But if you could tell me, maybe I can be able to know. If you guys know the song. No, no, that song. Now, moving on, guys. We have been making uh, some... We're basically almost done. <laughs> Cutting the onions and... Chef uh, Atakwana Jueyo. And then nyanya, <laughs> uh, but 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 uh, I, I told you guys my mixing is usually just on that on that pneumatic five burner. That's where my mixing is at. <laughs> uh, what, uh, if I tell you guys to flambe that, how will you flambe it? Hmm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that is not something. You see, the thing is, this is something that, no, we will not even get into that. Yeah. Now, uh, we're cutting the tomatoes. This is going to be for the gravy that's going to go into that meatball. Now, Chef, we have you uh, basically searing the meatballs, yes? Uh -huh. Go ahead. You may go ahead and sit down uh -huh. you. as you have a drink. Now, we so, have first the, meat, the meatballs that were prepared earlier, yeah. just done. Uh, we're basically going to give these other ones a sear. We have our condiments ready, mm. which is going to create the sauce that we're going to be using, yes? So now, we're Chef. We're going to start with that. Okay, we're going to start with that. Yeah, so now, Nanya yeah. to Eh? New water. Eh? Yeah. Ah, yeah. Now we have Chef has just poured a little bit of oil there. How many tablespoons of oil, Chef? So let's say two tablespoons. Uh -huh. Make sure. In goes the shallots, the yeah. red, red, onions. red onions. Of course, you can use any other onions. Go ahead. Yes, you, you shall be the one to mix that up. No, come there, Leo. You, you're leaving knowing how to make this sub mm. without a doubt, at yes? Least, at least I cook for someone. Yes. One day, one time. One day, one time. Really? <laughs> God willing. God willing. Those are good dreams. Don't worry about that. That will definitely cup. happen. Huh? Yeah. yeah? Good. Bullet. These are not bullets. They're not bullets. They're not, uh, hey, bullets. But uh, it's not even a curry, Sana. But you want to make like some chili sauce with it. Is this habanero? Are they habaneros? No, I they're don't not. Know, no. These are just like ordinary chilies. We'll find out what they're Until, called, guys. Yeah. But they are sold in the supermarkets as well. Golden brown, golden brown. Golden brown is what you want them to be. Yeah, golden brown. Hey, Yeah, yeah, li Google. Yeah, 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 li Google. All right. Now we have you a, a very thinly slicing that. Can you see mm -hmm. how finely you're chopping them? Is that how you require them to be? Oh, yeah. And why is that? That's like a big big chunks for you because um, just want to. Uh, They'll wither down with, while cooking. After cooking, I'll have to at least that was soft. Okay. At least that okay, put to the flavor, everything. Okay. Mm. So you want to chop those. Now, would you like him to help you with that one since as how you have shown him the but, slices but that you I, require? I just want to ask a question. Yes. yes. How do we do that? You know? I'm just saying, ah, I'm like, I'm like, you know, an opportunity to I'm teach like, him. Hey, I'm like, hey. In fact, a, a lot of guys, even at home, maybe you can be able to learn as they go. And you can be able to tell us what, of course, with our very handy board, that's from Paris Land. You can find the shop at Two Rivers Ground Floor. And of course, you can follow them on Facebook as well, just to get to see a little bit more of what they have in their store. Now, that very lovely, colorful pink uh, I'd love to have it in my kitchen, honestly. Uh, board is from Paris land. And uh, Chef is just going to show you how to chop that uh, carrot um, right off the back. All right, yeah. Chef. So, I'll show, I'll I'll show, I'll show you first time. 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 I'
you know na hii ya first up you have to put it down make sure kidole yako inde kwa kwanza hii kwa nyuma hii alafu utambi kwa nyuma ndio ishikilie kula aha then naona malikisi yuko aha that's on a stroke to pole pole tu and with time you get your speed to na chapato tizi kila siku tu naenda kula nya good Yeah. And that's why God created yeah. Adam and Eve. Naona mtu kenda mtaani bila. Ha? Ha. Jaribu. All right. No, now um <laughs> now here goes your first attempt. You want to be careful please. We do not <laughs> want anybody cutting their <laughs> fingers <laughs> on set. It's, it's, it's not easy. It's not easy. It's now not you easy. will realize that the knife is constantly on the board. Mm. Uh, so one end of the knife is constantly on the board. So there's a motion there that you want to have nice. um, as you go that. Now, oh. as he's, yeah, there you go. You're almost hey, having yeah. it. Now, as oh, he's too. practicing, of course, you guys at home could also oh. practice this technique of cutting. It's way Actually, faster. Actually, I'm opening, I'm the opening something. Come out perfect. <laughs> now, we will be going on a short break and we'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back guys. This is Hot Plate and today we are with DJ Mickey and DJ Wash is it what? It's V. Vicky. No, V DJ. Put that V. V. Watch out. Watch out. Ah, we're in Tanga. Ah, it's true. It's it's DJ Mickey. Yeah, V. Yeah. Okay. Piano V DJ. No, me. Who is that DJ? Mini Wash. Eh, Wash when you saw. And today we're making our with both subs. So, uh, as you can see, yapa tunguzi me caramelize the pour sana good job mm. kenya nataka sasa tuongeze hapa nyanya ongeza nyanya yeah. pia mimi niambie good job good job good job wewe wewe hapa umeja wacha ini nini ina kaki tana hii tutatumia baadaye that is a very good question <laughs> That's a very yeah, good question. <laughs> 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 Now that's actually uh it's an applicator. You can use it for marinades on your meat. It's just yeah. a silicone based. Nika zile brush up. Nika brush too. Eh, yeah, but yeah, you yeah. you oh. use it to applicate marinades on like chicken or meat Bas. as you cook. Ndio si chomeke and you don't have those bristles. Applicator ni apply. Eh, ndio apply. At least I use that one. Do it. <laughs> All right. Now we have Now, our tomatoes in yeah, there. Yeah. So tomatoes to make andani. Yes. We're just going to let that sit kidogo at least the break down hapo kiasi. Mm -hmm. Now tunaanza na na wasab sasa. And what we're going to do? After how long uh, I mean, how mm. long are you supposed to cook the meat balls? The meat balls. Yeah. Unataka tu yo brown. We just say at lazima even paka andani because it stays to sharp andani. Let's stay when you soup wa raka raka. Afu unajua beef pia inanga shida unaweza kulata hivyo. Eh? Mhm. Eh? <laughs> yeah, moving on. Aitakona beef. To say. So we're going to get leave that is sima kidogo hadi hizo manyanya zivunjike vunjike at least to party up stew yake ni poa. Haya, so uh, wacha tuache hivi kiasi tuweke mafuta kidogo. Hiyo ndio nini kwa hapo chef? Now we're going to make the what's it called? Uh, we're going to use the butter with some coriander. And now apply it on top of the bread. You know, guy, you let your pongas choose it. Really? Need any? Nastia. We need any? Two ni kumbi two. Aya, when do you take that? Iyo koriander, ba una mumbi ani need any? All right, guys. So we're gonna chop that up, and that's gonna be used uh, to apply on the bread. Yes. Now we have a little bit of butter that's gonna get melted. Let's go for it. We have your your butter. We have your take for your pan. Now that's the butter that's just going to go straight into the pan. Mm -hmm. And that's And about that, how what? many tablespoons of butter, chef? You I put like three, three, three tablespoons. large ones, yeah. Okay. Like three large ones. Mm. So for the bread, we're going to cut it even. Now that is so that what, chef? So so hapo ndo mali tutaset hizo meatballs once they are ready. Ah. Now come basic design zako chef so we're not going to cut it the normal way that we use to cut no. our hot dogs. Hapana. Ah okay. Alafu hiyo part ya juu una unakula ama bado itabaki? Ngoja utaona. All right that is actually a question that I was going to ask so if you yeah. are interested as to what chef is doing yeah. uh you want will you do when I say pretty and just find out what we're going to do with it. Now other meatballs meatballs does stuff it. Zitatosha. Hey have patience manzi. Sawa basi. Kini chef, kwa na miki mimbreko, yuko kazi yote. Nisi kazi moja. Let me ask you a simple question. Mimi ni mimi ni metoka job, 
nimetoka so because basically ni ufanya job so ni jioni ndio nitoke job fine would you advise me to make this should i have to go through the process na niko na njana acha ndo kwambie lazima acha ndo kwambie kitu moja na kupika once umemaliza hiyo satisfaction utakuwa nayo ya kupula food nimevika sasa hiyo hata kama umebaki umepika for years hiyo utafurahia oh so it goes ha so like finish you remember the the lasagna bread we made clear yes now since we're going to use the what's it called the sauce we're going to put that low is 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 if any kwa soggy ndani and also the butter to the side so some cut since we're going to put that in the oven yes uh-huh. now that is amazing guys i don't know if you're seeing that a lot of people tend to take the bread out mm. and leave it hollow but because of the fact that we will be incorporating a sauce that we are making we don't want the bread to get soggy so that top layer will act as a seal uh, from soaking in all those juices from the what what's it called from the the sauce that we're making yes, yes? Uh, all right now uh-huh. that looks perfect uh, in goes the coriander goes the coriander Uh, is there any garlic that's going in there? No, the manila garlic. Ah, no. Uh, some powder, uh, garlic powder. Get some garlic powder please. Okay. Now, kwa na koroga pia hapo. Msisahau pia mnapika vitu vingi. Now, they are basically mixing up the sauce that's going to go into that. We have a little bit of butter and some coriander and some garlic powder that's gone in there. Na ndio hiyo sasa kichana mlikuwa mnaulizia. Oh, sasa sasa. It's just basically an applicator that we will be applying on the bread. Kuna kula carrot. Kuna carrot hakuna shida. Now, we're going to go ahead and just applicate that right on top. Yes. And then uh, what goes next chef? So after that, nazataka ini butter na coriander. Yes. Uh, okay. And then tell me cheese kala apo. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're going to ask you first to wash your hands as we open the cheese. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Because we have to rinse out. <laughs> 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 we have to rinse out everything else that we touch because we will be touching cheese which is just this is going to be melted. Mm-hmm. Um and then what we're going to do there you go. What you're going to do is you're going to need to open those cheese up. Um I feel like that is going pretty well in that yeah. it is breaking down. Uh we're going to need the uh, tomatoes and the and the what is it called? uh the carrots to break down completely yes. we have yes. our yes. meatballs yes. still searing there which look perfect i just wanted to give them a turn mm. and chef has just coated that with butter and coriander yes? yes all right chef now what's the next process okay so we're just going to apply some cheese inside okay and yes, thank you Now any cheese gani chef can you use any form of cheese is it a mozzarella yes you can use any form you okay. can use cheddar mozzarella you can use Now that I can use this one actually got parmesan the, parmesan maybe like if you use it now not to sprinkle on top after once okay okay ready, yes but this is better so the cheddar and the um mozzarella is the best for this sub yeah. this I, is because I think I would prefer even the mozzarella since it's so stringy it's stringy yeah. yes oh yes definitely eh una penga cheese ndio mimi nasikia two times two na dunia eh nimekula lakini sasa eh It's Is okay. It? Alafu neka. Huh? These are the types of cheese uh-huh. that you use. Kai ile inakonga kwenye pizza ni mozzarella. Na hilo just sabe mimi pasta na nisijui hiyo. Mimi najua kukula hiyo. Oh, kukula hiyo pizza. That's my job. That's my job. That's your job to eat the pizza. All right. Now I can see you're doing a pretty good job with that. Yeah, we have the cheese going on in there. Now chef, what is going to go next please? Uh what is that that you have there, chef? Okay, so now we're just going to season it. And since we put like too many tomatoes. Mm-hmm. Now clear mambo yako tutaingiza leo. Nini? Sukar. Sukar. You have to put sugar just to cut down the acidity of mm-hmm. tomatoes. I'm telling you That's guys, so I've gotten so many inboxes for Claire. Wo pika na sukar. I'm like, "Yes, I do cook with sugar." This is because it adds it brings out the seasoning in there. It brings out the salt mm-hmm. and the different flavors that you incorporate in your meal. Mm-hmm. And of course, for tomatoes, it's good for cutting through that acidity. But a pinch. Si atu ke kijuko kama una chai. No, just a pinch the same way you put sugar. <laughs> exactly. So just put a, I mean salt. Just put a pinch of it. Yeah. Uh now I've seen chef has done that already yeah. into that. We have the cheese just lining up. Uh chef what goes next to the sauce? Okay, so uh we'll, we'll uh, uh, just add some um, beef cubes. Yes. Just to make some make some um uh, uh stock of course. Uh-huh. So we'll just break it down first and then add some water. 
How some does that some look? Some people will put some wine. I've learned something. Yes, yes, yes. I've learned something today. Kumbe sukari si a chai peke yake. Kumbe sukari na pika chakuli. Ina pika. Ni chakuli kwa mzaidi. Exactly. It does not hurt to put a little. Ala kwenye stew, ila una kupika nga ugali. Nayo. Just put a pinch of sugar. For real? I promise you it's going to be delicious. Mm-hmm. I know, I, I got that facial expression a lot, guys. But just put a pinch of sugar mm-hmm. and then let me know. I got people who actually tried it and they were like, you know what, Claire, it's not that bad. So just, I love, I'm the sugar queen. The chef will draw, kila kitu na pika, lazima neke pinch of sugar. Kido go to? Ata kwenye mtu nwe kama kwa stiwa nyama hivu. Stiwa nyama diyo ata kwanza na tia sugar kabisa. Honey? Uh, I, know, I know about honey. You can put honey, yes, mm-hmm. but it's just better a pinch of sugar. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's not a must though. It's an option especially when cooking with the tomato paste and tomatoes. Mm. Yeah, a pinch of sugar does not hurt. Mm. In fact, funny thing, uh, we had a guest alikuwa anasema tia aiki aiki chumvi kwenye mayai. The way she fries her egg and a cascar. Mm. I've never tried it. <laughs> Honestly, I never have. I don't know if I will. Uh, but it's a very interesting. We'll actually be having this guest joining us very soon. So we'll see how that sugar and egg goes. I'm not too sure about it. All right, now what do we have going on there, chef? Nandini hapo mlabu ta atakusaidia na kukata akate vipi? He's right behind you. Yeah, hamesha ona. Yes. Nataka tu akate lengthways. Yes. Now see, please be careful you're dealing with peppers. Hakuna hatutaki mtu aanze kuwashwa na macho. So you want to make sure that you rinse your hands immediately after this tafadhali. Okay. Mm. Now we have how many peppers do you need to go in there chef? Na kwa nini unatia pilipili mingi hivyo? Eh? Yeah, I'm making this sauce to your inje to ile. Ni sauce ya inje hii. Kuna iko na jina mbaya lakini unajua watu wengine wanasamanga Oh, is it called chocolate? Did you go to Gina Flora? What is it called, chef? What is it called? Now I'm very curious. Yeah, so am I. I'm sure you guys at home are just as curious as to what this <laughs> this sauce we're making is yeah. called. Uh, what is it called? Uh, it's called manna from hell. Okay, yes. <laughs> we are definitely not going to call it what it's called because I don't want no manna from hell. I want some manna from heaven. So, um I you know it was that's And okay. why is it called that? Because it's too spicy. I if I had like the jalapeno yes, peppers. Yes, yes. It's me. extremely you, spicy. You know why it's called that. Yeah. yeah. All right. Now we have so, you mashing the tomatoes. Yeah. Why is that? Uh it's better even for me even like to blend the sauce. Mm-hmm. But I didn't get something. Mm-hmm. So we just use the masher and we'll just use it to mash all the tomatoes in the back a little bit as as the break down bizuri. Mm-hmm. And then like you put a tiny simmer. Mm-hmm. And then here we have the peppers, right? Yes. Make a moto kiasi. Yes. Just add a cup of vinegar. A cup of vinegar. Yeah. All right. Um is there anything that you need them to help you with or may I ask them to sit and down? And just now? let it sit there at least to make it easy. We blend it up. Okay. That will be the best sauce ever. All right. Now we're going to ask you gentlemen to kindly uh-huh. have a seat because I feel like we have most of it bagged down. Now chef, are you going to be using the oven at any one point yes, and should I, I turn am. it on for please you? Please do, please do because we'll just take like 10 minutes for the cheese to melt. Yeah. And the bread to cook. Yes. All right, just make sure you turn on the fan when we put it in there. So we just put the top and the uh, bottom burner on. Um I have it at 180 degrees. Uh, based on the oven that you have at home, then you can just temper with, I mean, play with the temperature, but you mm-hmm. don't want to put it too high because you may burn your bread before yes. you melt your cheese. We don't All right. Do that. Now we have the stew. Yeah. Okay, put okay. The in. We have the meatballs going in. Mm-hmm. Now are you not going to put in these ones? That's so okay, no problem. It will add more texture. So. Yes, to the sauce. We're not going to leave no meat. Oh, no, no, chef. Yeah, I'll doesn't yeah. judge me. Ah, no, 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 no. Mm-hmm. We're not going to leave any meatballs. Even if they break, guys, you do not want to leave them because it will still add, the meat will break in that sauce and mm. it will still have the texture that yes, you want, yeah? All right. Now, I can see the carrots are still there, so they're going to be mm. able to add the, to the sweetness of the sauce. Nice. Whew, my mouth is watering like I can't even, I can't even <laughs> talk. Are you, guys, are you guys on the same page? Is that <laughs> right? Yeah. Just mm. waiting for this. And, of course, you guys will be able to recreate this meal as well at home easily. Mm. Yeah, easy. Actually, I think we can do a challenge. We can do a challenge. Mkifika nyumbani. Shida ni moja. Nini? Yeah, kuna oven. Now, chef, that is actually a very good question. Nikoniulize. Kama una oven. 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 Kama una o
Une, if I cook with the same way chef showed us how to make the um, pizza on a pan, mm -hmm. it's the same way you can be oh, able like to make this. Una zaka okay. yeah. imkati yeah. kwenye pan, very low heat. Mm -hmm. Now, uhakikisha uh, kamba ukona lid that seals the top completely. Okay. So, kifunika, okay, your cheese ita melt yenyewe. Oh. Yeah, in that heat. So, the point so that's is to make To melt the cheese, okay. to make it nice and stringy. That's the only point. But chef, chef said you can also enjoy it just like that. Mm. It will be just as good because when you put the hot meatballs on the cheese, ita melt yenyewe pia. Oh. Yeah, so you just want to do that, okay, chef? Now yeah. we have that. Pr uh, you, I see you adding a I little bit of salt. I hope you guys have no more sinuses it's gonna get hot here. It's gonna get hot. Can you sneeze up? Ah, you chew me a little tosha. Hmm? Actually, for Nisha Pia, we're just gonna do just a little bit of sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I've noticed one. Hey, thing, yeah? it works. Trust me, chef. I know it works. It's gonna. Sorry, you're saying you've noticed one thing. You love sugar. I it's do love sugar. Let me tell you one thing about sugar. Sugar. It's so interesting. I've learned something. I've learned something. Yes. Sugar makes the difference in a meal. You see the way I've done that. The chili sauce is gonna have that sweetness. I don't want it to be with the sweetness. I want it to be hot. That's why I gave it that name. Now, guys, if you do not want to add sugar. <laughs> like chef, you do not want you do not want to add that sugar. But trust me, he's gonna enjoy this a lot more just because I've added that sugar. Yeah, no, that really <laughs> 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 All right, now so, we're gonna go ahead and soak. And uh, what are we gonna do there? So, okay, so we want to blend the chili. Okay. And we're just gonna put them one by one. Do stacky kumaga. Okay. Kila kitu. And then um. As I, you can you can smell the it's a bit. The vinegar. Yep. Yes, it's amazing. It's almost like pickling your um an easy yes. way to pickle yeah. your your peppers. Yes. Um and it's a very good way to do that as well. This is actually how they heat. make uh, Tabasco. Now you were telling us something as well, yes? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Before I, I wanted I wanted to add on a comment. Huh? Yes. You said about helping a DJ. Uh mm huh. -hmm. I think you also help someone mm -hmm. who's helping himself. Yes. So you see, idea, na we mo nyere You see, like for me, for me, I pushed myself. Ukombele. Yeah. Then from there, I did kapata bugika entertainment. So okay. since ilete me ni lejo ni bugika, they saw, hey, you know what, this guy can make it. Yeah. So what you have to chukue to build to be something else better. Okay. You know. Now, pia yeye mnyere kuna maliata ni saidia. Mm. Lakini pia ndio ni saidia lazima pia oni pia mi ni kuhili. Yeah. Ni saidia as much as yeah. Mm. Mm. All right. Mm. So you have to be able to help yourself first for you yeah, to, yeah. to show the effort, right? Yeah, you have you have to show the effort and discipline. Yes. There's someone watching. Yeah, mm -hmm. always. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, guys, the sauce I'm going to put on is up before. Mm -hmm. And uh, I see the meatballs are going to go in there as well. Chef, you're going to put on the stuff with TVP. We'll make it fit. Okay. No way possible. All right. I've got the oven on. We're basically just about to layer it up. Mm -hmm. And of course, I have to sample that chili, which I did put sugar. <laughs> You just have to take the credit because you are going to chew No, it's it's amazing, <laughs> chef. Of course, I'm still going to make this nah, chili you. at home with Let sugar. Me ask. <laughs> Let me ask. No, Let me ask. Now, garlic. Huh? Let me ask a simple question. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, for someone when you have easy part, easy ingredients. Ingredients. Ganizo. Ganizo. No, no, no. This is what I mean. Easy part. No, you know, you know. We have to cook. 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 Maybe for example, you know, you look at places. Yeah. Maybe there are some people who are not able to get these things, mm -hmm. but still they want to make. The same, Them. same thing. How, ah, yeah. how, how, how? Kuna kitu ile basic. Eh, kuna ile kitu mm. basic kabisa. Kuna hii garlic powder. Mm -hmm. So, kuna garlic, kuna hizi apata yeah. anywhere. Mm -hmm. Therefore, substitute garlic powder na garlic. Mm -hmm. Aya, wana hii uh, paprika. Mm -hmm. Unajua hoho ya red? Mm -hmm. Tumia hoho ya red. Mm -hmm. Kuna kitu ingine? Hapo umetumia language. Adi limelewa hoho ya red. <laughs> <laughs> So guys, uh -huh. there is no way you cannot find some of these ingredients. Oh. You can easily substitute with the fresh version because easy to make spices that must be kaushwa and then have been ground and put in a can dos nauzwa. But they are from uh, easy kayan. It's chili. Mm -hmm. Chili is make a dried whatever. Mm -hmm. These herbs, which herbs are these, chef? Oh yeah, um, those uh, thyme and, and oregano. Thyme and oregano, okay, mm. kwaibuizo sasa. Yeah. You can also find them. This one is a spot, by the way, kwasoko, but say fresh. Fresh, yeah. Ule, ule, ule mtuwa interior kabisa, unajua maybe ya hezi ya lewa hiyo ni. 
Interior. Eh, No, it's okay. Fine yeah, now. Because you know, you, you, I can go and tell. Eh, Miss Idea, Miss Idea. What have you said? Time. Time. Ni onde Miss Idea time. You kwanza wa mamboga ndo na ijo vizuri. Hapo wezi wa chocha hapo. So aku, so every mama mamboga lazima kwa na. Okay, so ati wale ati wa inje mtani. Wewe si unajua soko yenyewe. Soko tutaka. Mtaa yako hiyo unasema local. Mimi nenanga kwa soko. Soko. Ni sawa. Kuna local lenye hizi kwa hizi. Kanyage matope eh? No no. Ari? Now guys, we're basically doing the last touches before yeah. we pop it into the oven. Yeah. We're just popping some cheese on there. We yeah. have the meatballs Email in the you. bread. I love to make the meatballs. So you have you so ah oh, so una no, batch kidogo ndio ikaika inafunika. Eh yeah, sasa iki melt utaona mm-hmm. itakunika ita, itafunika nyama yote na zitaziweka tu pamoja tu yenye zita chana ama nini. Mm-hmm. Hot. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. No el kuna nyama. Eh? Hmm? Yeah, <laughs> mega scary. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah. All right guys, now we are going to pop that into the oven. Let me do the honors please. I am so happy about this now. <laughs> straight into the oven. Of course, I have that on. Ooh, okay, uh maybe too high. Uh, I just want to melt that so I have that at the top. Mm-hmm. And of course, let's give that like 10 minutes or less. Less and of course, we have our fan on. Actually, I'm just going to raise it up so that I can melt the cheese faster. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah? All right, good idea. And we have our fan on to evenly distribute that heat. Mm-hmm. All right, now guys, this comes the best part, which we are going to get to eat the food. I know, right? <coughs> Then you tell us how you feel. Like. <laughs> 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 All right, you're ready? Now, ready, ready, Chef, ready. it's mm. an option for you to put the sauce or not, yeah? Hmm? It's an option for you to put the sauce hmm. or not, or no. Like it's it's advisable yeah. It's advisable okay, that's, that's the, the hot sauce. Like the hot sauce. The hot sauce. Ah, here that's for your own preference. Kona penda some chili hapo kiasi. Okay, then you can put. Mm. Would you guys mind some chili? Mm, mild. Musichoche ati ati. Yes, yeah, yeah, you could juri. Kule nyumezoea. Kule nyumezoea. Ka utaki usikule ato jaribu. All right guys, now we are going to give that just a few more minutes and then we'll get to eating. Isha kuwa, isha kuwa, cheki tunatoa. <laughs> oh my gosh, are we on air? <laughs> All right, now so this is a moment of truth. Of course, we are going to cut that up and mm. gobble it. I hope you guys don't mind cheese because I love me some cheese. Of course, do enjoy making this sub in your very kitchen. Of course, the chili, you can preserve it by adding a little bit of oil and putting it into the fridge mm. and then use it. And then of course, keep checking if it's fresh because I know it can stay for up to even three weeks. You know? Yeah, the chili. The chili it's in one week. One week, uh, huh? Okay, but in the but, fridge? But we'll get a freezer when they got a... Three weeks. Three weeks yes, yeah. yeah. And because of the vinegar, it is also a natural preservative. Mm. All right, guys, that wraps up. I am about to dig in with the DJs. Thank you so much for joining us in the kitchen. We do hope you had a good time. Mm. Yeah, yes? Really did, of course, you can leave your handles one last time for people to be able to find your music. Uh, you can check me out on Instagram, at WashDJ, Twitter, at WashDJ, uh, Facebook page, The Fusionist, uh, YouTube, WashDJ, ni what you mean link di by the kila mahali ni kila mahali actually uh, across all uh, platforms is to is for facebook facebook the fusionist hizo zingine at wash dj yeah whatsapp ni 07 <laughs> and when can we catch you on the edge here on uh, the grill you can always check me out on the edge every thursday uh, from 5 to 6 skere yeah. reggae yeah skere reggae like any <laughs> i play anything i uh, can also mm-hmm. also i also play at uh, smurf whiskey bar along uh, gumba road on your way to yepkbl next napo every friday wow. all yeah. right and how about you <laughs> for me uh, at vdj miki kila mahali everywhere mimi nitafute utanipata mm. everywhere vdj miki don't forget also www.vdjmiki.com apart from that kama kawaida kama ibada each and every wednesday and sunday i'm always live at memphis bar pale usa euro also each and every friday catch me live from 10 to 2 hot 96 that is amazing thank you so much for joining us here yeah. in the kitchen 
let's get to eating. Good night <laughs> from me, Claire Carato. <laughs> and I'm Chef <laughs> Bennett. Have a lovely night, guys. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>